Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? Welcome to a new series called Red Dead Redemption 2 Online Walkthrough Gameplay Part 1, Creating Character. I created my character called James Bowman, uh, which this is the grandfather of James Bowman, by the way, guys. In case you don't know, James Bowman, the regular James Bowman we're talking about, did not exist in the 1800s, guys. So I had to take his grandfather and then, it, and then his other dad came along. His dad came along, and then he was his dad. Then he had James Bowman in the late 1990s, which was was a coincidence. But guys, make sure you guys drop, make sure you guys drop a like, and make sure the uh, like button turns blue. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys make the subscribe button turn red. And also, guys, make sure you guys do not forget to uh, click that notification bell. Make sure it turns blue. And also, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter so we can hit the goal of 1.6k. And uh, also on Twitter, if we Instagram, if we can hit the goal of 3,000, three uh. 3k followers that would be really amazing but guys um make sure you guys join my discord server help us hit 60 members make sure you guys ch check out my heavy unboxing youtube channel as well ladies and gentlemen let's go so here i am trying to complete mission sorry you guys didn't get to see the customization of the character i had to cut that out of the video because the video was about 49 minutes long could not I could not do anything about the size of the video. It's just like I cut the video down, guys. I cut most of that out of the video. Sorry about that, because uh, most of it was video was already too long. It was like almost 50 minutes long, so I couldn't really do anything about it. So. That's how it was, guys. He had to survive, or he had to survive. That's how it was. He was back in the 1800s. Um, James Bowman's grandfather was a bounty hunter. He was basically, he, basically, what he wanted was to survive, and he would do anything to survive. That's how he was. Like he had to shoot and take what was his at the end. He had to take it. If James Bowman got to meet his grandfather, he would have been he would have been surprised who he was. What type of person he turned out to be? Most of all. But like, he never got to meet him because when James Bowman was born, his grandfather wasn't around to see him anymore. But his dad told him some nice stories about his grandfather back in the eight, from the 1800s. And that's what it was. And it's not that he was a he was a person to be likely likely as but that's that's how he was $50 I could buy another one of these I'm gonna buy focus fire I'm gonna buy this I have a thousand bucks too. Nothing, nothing to waste. Eclipsed. That's just how it was with James Bowman's uh, grandfather. He was not a person that was likely took it as a as a person that was dumb. He was a smart person in school. Back when he used to go, he was the class of like 18, 1840 something probably. I don't know, 1840 something. And then, he, and then, he, and after he graduated and stopped coming to school, he he became an explorer. That's what he became. He could not become anything else. 
That's what type of person he became at the end. He, he really was into this bounty hunting stuff. That's how he was. And then James Bowman's dad was into learning how to wrestle. And then James Bowman, the legend James Bowman we're talking about, wanted to be just like his dad. And then basically what his grandfather was like, he didn't he didn't have the same footsteps as as the uh, as of how his grandfather was. But he was more different. <laughs> uh, just James Bowman was just like that guys. He couldn't really do anything about it. He was just followed. Following the footsteps of his dad. His grandfather, he had that. He had that. Attitude where he wasn't known as a dummy. He was smart. He knew he was smart. And, and that's the thing about it. He wasn't known as that. He wasn't known as a dummy. And I weren't gonna complete this really quickly. And stop it right there. I just shot. I just shot for a warning shot. Alright, we're just gonna restart right there. That was my fault. I didn't mean to do that. In this game, you can't really die that easily unless you run into an online player. But, uh, this is uh, Red Dead Online, by the way. But we're, we're calling it Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. So, just in case you don't know. Uh, that is just what James Woman's grandfather had to do to survive. And his, his family wasn't really that rich in the 1800s either. They had, to, they had to do everything that was possible to survive out here in this world. In the 1800s world. They had to make a house that was in the middle of the wildness. Basically, the house they made wasn't really... It wasn't really... That, that good of a house. It was just like a first house.
But that's just how he had to survive, guys. His family didn't have a lot of money. They did. This was before there was actually James Bowman at all. This was before there was anybody. <laughs> It was it was very it was a very weird era for for a family, but the footsteps were were really weird. I know, but but I have to tell you, I have to tell you. The era of the 1800s with the James Bowman family, there was no James Bowman uh, 1, 2. It was just James Bowman 1, the first James Bowman, and then that was it, the original James Bowman. And then, and then what, they, what they had did was they basically made... And, um... Also, James Bowman had a friend named. He also had a friend named Clay Dave. He had a friend named Clay Dave, and his friend Clay David was. He known him since he was around, but the story was. That's what it was. But we're going to try this out and then we're going to end it and see what's happening. Like I said, it wasn't that easy for, for for the first James Bowman, and it was with the with the era. They were really worried. They were. again <laughs> did Hortley send you pop I'm Clay Davies this is my brother Clive he don't talk maybe you two will get along better <laughs> maybe not listen I heard you wanted to earn some money so there's a gang of ne'er-do-wells they are a bunch of degenerates not good people they're out in roads with a bunch of horses they stole off of me <laughs> Well, that's a lie, but they stole them off a fella I was gonna steal them off of. <laughs> Maybe you could get them for me. You think you could do that for me, Pop? Looks like you're doing this on your own. Well, good. Meet me at the stable at San Denis once you have the horse flesh, and I'll pay you good. Oh, and Pop, Horley wanted me to remind you any decent work you can find. Take they did not grow up rich, guys. Try to stay out if of you trouble. think that. Oh, and once no. you give me those horses, well, after that, we'll talk again. Oh, I do so enjoy these conversations. I'm used to them on account of my brother. Let's go, Clive. They didn't, they didn't have, they didn't have that money, guys. They had to, they had to get money sooner or later. And that's how it was for, for the Bowman family. The first generation is over.
And this is just the game mode you can play in the game, by the way. It was just not this simple for them, guys. They had to learn sooner or later. First generations of the family were were not that rich. The second generations was. They, they weren't they weren't that much. And you, you may think that, you may think that, but that rich guys Say, trust me when I say it. Wasn't no without no James without the second generation James Bond. It. it was a lot. It was a lot more difficult than it seemed, guys. Without the second generation version of it. without the second generation of it. it was a lot more difficult than the first generation raising the second generation. It was. He was also really good at shooting. As you can see. He was also really good at shooting, guys. He was a legend at shooting, as you can see. Never stopped. He always looked behind him, he always watched around him. Cause no telling who was who was looking for him. He always did. He didn't care 
He didn't care who was trying to kill him. He killed them before they tried to kill him. It was a bounty out for, for the for the uh it was trying to look for him. They, they tried. Nobody didn't care what was happening. No man care what was happening, guys. It's just how it was for him. Hey. And and that's how the story was written, guys. If you didn't like how the story was written, it wasn't it wasn't no James Woman was born like before all of them. No. It started it started way differently. Everyone expected. Everyone expect. Well, well, well. Horley was right about you. Dead right. Ain't that dandy? Get that horse hidden away, Clive, and ready to move out as soon as we can. Right. Here's the money you earned. Now listen, Horley came by and gave me a message. He said to go see your friend Cripps up at your camp. Now listen to me for a second. Any other decent horses you find, we'll buy them. Just as soon as we are set up. Okay. Nice Everybody speech. thought that. You know but what? It didn't start out Hold that on, way. Boy. The story was written I differently. I call him boy because I'm older. Thirty minutes, he went black. <laughs> Let's give our friend here back the horse. It's yours. A sign of faith and future business. If you want to buy any extras or sundries for the animal, head inside. They've got a lot available. See you soon. <laughs> Come on, Clive. It wasn't as easy, guys. You had to start off somewhere. They only had a thousand dollars. It wasn't that rich. A thousand having a thousand bucks wasn't that rich. Then it wasn't. <laughs> I can sit here and talk about it all I want to, but it's really not. As simple. I'm not naming it. I don't want to rename the horse. Um. Kentucky. Kentucky. Kentucky Bowman. I don't know. Kentucky Bowman. I don't. I don't think that's a good name. I don't know. Settle. Add settle. Empty slot. All right. Here we go. It wasn't that simple, guys. It was really, like, tricky for them to get up in the world. We're in this here, guys. I think we're gonna wrap it up right here, guys. I think I'm, I think I'm good. But uh, yeah, we can't end yet. Why? Actually, game. Guess so. Uh, we're going to continue that in the next episode, guys. It's just that 
the next part of the game. But if you guys enjoyed Red Dead, uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, aka Red Dead Online, uh, let me know in the comments if you did. Make sure you guys drop a like and make sure you guys make that uh, like button turn blue. Make sure you guys click that notification bell, and it will be it will turn blue, guys. And also, make sure you guys click that notification bell as well, guys, so you can be notified here on YouTube. Also, make sure you guys do not forget to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and follow me on all of my social medias. Make sure you guys do not forget to uh, stay connected with me on my Discord server. Join my Discord server. Stay. keep. You can stay posted there, guys. But uh, that is it for me. That is part one. And part one is amazing. And I hope part two is amazing, more amazing than part one. I'll see you guys in the next part of Red Dead Online, aka Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. See you guys in the next part of Red Dead 2 Online. Thanks for watching. Bye.